Hi, good morning. Good morning, Annie. Annie, be nice. Go, Bryson, go. Go, Bryson. Go, Bryson, go, go. Go, Anaset. And how was your morning this Saturday? Good morning, Amy with 100 plus. I'm gonna get dizzy. Abandoned dogs of Everglades, Florida. Good morning, I'm okay, thank you for asking. Guys, you have to continue, you have to go on. So I just want all of you to know when I do all these, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm going in circles so you can follow, but they're very quick. Um, when I do these videos and share, I want you to know that not for one second, not for one second am I not thinking of Zora and making sure that we continue our fight for Zora. That's all I can think about, really. Aw, oh, thank you, Haley. I don't sleep, no. Last night I had three hours, the night before I had two. But it's okay, it's okay. I'll sleep when I'm dead. Go, babies, go, 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 go. Annie Set, Anna Set, and Bryson are tearing up the yard at Rescue House 2 this morning. And if you notice, Waffle's not in the mix. Look at you guys, get all your energy out. Go, 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 go. Zora's mom is a mess. Um, I am actually uh, trying to, Anna set. I am actually trying to find her a hotel um, for a week, two weeks, three weeks until she can get on her feet. Uh, so that's my focus and we are going, we're waiting on um, Zora's remains, um, cremation, and then we are going to coordinate a, a ceremony um, for Zora. And we're going to make it a beautiful ceremony to celebrate her life. Waffle's not here. Waffle went to a foster with two other dogs and a beautiful home and a beautiful family. The other day, um, Zoe and Shelly took him over and let's just say he is loving life. So we'll keep you posted on that, but um, I should be hopefully going to their home to finalize the hopeful adoption for Waffle. Um, Maria, I don't know when yet, but it's going to be coming up soon for Zora. Um, I will keep you posted every step of the way on our page. Um, it will be, the address will be posted um, for any of you that would like to come and pay your respects. Um, I will be doing, look at this, watch, watch, watch Bryson. Are you swimming this morning, Bryson? Huh? Are you swimming? Hi. I don't know. These are babies. These are my babies. This is what keeps me going. Right here. This right here. Um, I, Anna Set is the most amazing. Perfect. I can't believe for a six, seven month old. Look at her. That's all mange. That's why her hair is missing. 15 pounds. The best snuggle bug. And potty trained, not destructive, dog friendly. She's just perfection. Perfection. Absolute perfection. Bryson's perfection. Easy peasy. Perfection. I don't understand it. Bryson doesn't do well with new people. At first, he barks. Um, it, once he warms up to you, forget about it. He is one of my most favorite, favorite dogs. It's beautiful here today in South Florida. Sun is not really out yet. Overcast, and it's cool. There's a nice breeze. But um, I wanted to take this opportunity to say good morning first of all I'm gonna flip it on me I can't believe I'm doing this because I just literally rolled off the couch but it's okay um, so it's not a beauty contest right 
I wanted to take this opportunity to do this video um, because I always like to feature our dogs that are in need of homes. But at the same time, um, I was going to make a, a separate video, but while you're asking the questions, I'm going to answer them because that's what we do. Um, as far as Zora, everybody's reaching out. Everybody wants to know how they can help. Um, well, right now, it's in the hands of the officials. Um, we are going to be watching very, very closely. We are going to make sure that we do everything in our power uh, to keep the heat on and keep everybody focused and angry and not forget Zora. Um, you know, things like, things like this happen every day, all day, you see the news. If you just let it slip under the rug, it, nothing's going to happen. Um, the reason that we as a rescue organization um, use the media for a tool is to bring awareness. Um, you saw how viral this story went, as it should be. Uh, Zora was not only a 13-year-old senior, she was paralyzed. She could not walk, she couldn't stand up in that back seat of that car. She could not be seen and she could not be heard because those windows were up and tight. And all, the only reason, the only reason that somebody called on that car was because of the smell. So she died of suffocation, dehydration, a, a horrific, horrific, unimaginable murder. I'm not even going to say death. She was murdered. She was murdered. And I can't get, as I know from seeing all your comments, I can't get that out of my head or out of my heart, what she had to endure the last however long moments of her 13 years of life. Um, I, I, I just, I keep thinking about it and thinking about it and it makes me angry and it, it breaks my heart um, and it makes me want to continue to fight and speak louder and louder and louder for Zora. So I agree with you, um, Gabriella. I agree. An eye for an eye. Um, he's in jail. He's a 19 year old waste of life. He's a piece of garbage. And um, I hate even saying his name. So let me just say that we 100 plus abandoned dogs. Hi, you want to come up? Um, abandoned dogs of Everglades, Florida will continue to be that voice for Zora and we will continue to keep the heat on um, again uh, I, uh, Wanda is is a mess and she's in between places um, she was staying with a friend and she is literally in her car that's a lease uh, that I'm sorry that was given to her by Enterprise through the towing company uh, when I went to the towing company that evening, uh, they would not let us see the car. They would not let us see Zora. Um, Zora was in the car that evening. And the following, I believe it was the following day or the next day, I can't even remember at this point, but we received the call that we could, that Wanda could pick up her, do her car, sorry, her car. When she was in there filling out paperwork at the towing company, I was there with Joan Murray from Channel 4, who's amazing. Um, such a voice, such an amazing voice. When she reports, she reports from the heart. And I know because I spent a lot of time with her and I've worked with her for many years. So Joan Murray from Channel 4 News, Miami, thank you. Um, I wish we had more reporters like you. And all the reporters from the other stations, thank you. Um, but when we went there to the towing company, and I went in the back, it was raining outside in the back where the car was, Wanda did not. I told her to stay put uh, because I didn't know what I was going to see. So when I went there with Joan Murray um, and they opened the door, the smell before they opened the door and the maggots and the defecating, the defecation from Zora. Zora was not in the car, please. There's a lot of comments going around um, that, that I, I, I did the video for PR, like really 
are you people off your rocker? Like, do you honestly think that I would enjoy doing something like that or, or seeing something like that? I knew Zora was not in the car. Um, I, I, I decided to go live because I take you, our supporters, along for this roller coaster ride of, of rescue every step of the way. Um, and I chose to turn that camera on. So for anybody that has anything to say like that, please just save it. Just save it. I'd like to know what you're doing to help this 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 poor woman Wanda and her dog that was murdered. So I will keep everyone posted. I am staying and my team are staying focused on trying to help Wanda. I will not, um, I told Wanda, I'm not comfortable and I will not be collecting any money personally or through the organization um, for anything that Wanda may need. Now, what I will say is I would like to be able to get a hotel here in Fort Lauderdale for her because like I stated uh, just a little bit ago in this video, um, she's in her car. Uh, she's going into Publix restrooms to freshen up, um, running around. She calls me morning, noon, and night, and I told her I am here for her. So I will be with her to pick up Zora's remains um, from Coral Springs Animal Hospital where the necropsy was done. I will set up and get everything taken uh, care of for her, for her memorial service. Um, so she can have some kind of closure. Remember, she never was able to say goodbye, um, to touch or kiss or say goodbye to Zora. So she's dealing with a lot of guilt and um, she doesn't need anybody to remind her that what she did was, you know, a mistake, a horrible, horrible mistake. Um, and she has to live with that. So please refrain from uh, that. Um, so what we're going to do is uh, ask anybody if you are interested in helping Wanda um, we are looking to get a hotel for her maybe at a La Quinta or something around here that's reasonable an extended stay I have currently two people that are willing to help um, they were two people that originally reached out and wanted to up the, the reward when we were looking for the scumbag um, that stole the car and killed Zora so I reached back out to them and told them of Wanda's, Wanda's situation. They want to contribute um, and donate uh, three nights, four nights, five nights at a hotel. So for any of you that would like to donate a night or two at a hotel for Wanda until she gets on her feet so she can rest her head on a pillow um, with some clean sheets and a shower uh, just to give her some peace while she's running around and we're doing all of this please I'm going to put up our email address and all you have to do is send an email and subject it um, Zora and Wanda um, and let me know your name your phone number and that you would like to help Wanda no I'm not doing a GoFundMe um, it would be going through me personally or my organization and I'm just not comfortable with that um, and a set right there um, so again, I want to say thank you to each and every one of you for continuing uh, to be her voice. And um, Anna said, no, and uh, Bryson's chewing the arm of the chaise. Bryson, come here. Bryson, what's this? What's that? What's that? Um, excuse me, can I, have, can I have my shoe back, please? My um, can I have my slipper back, please, Anaset? Thank you. And Bryson, stop chewing the arm of the chair. Bryson, hey, no. Come on, Bry. See, you think you can get away with it when I'm doing my videos? You cannot do that. Come on, let's get the toys. Come on, let's play. Come on. Bryson, come. Bryson. Bryson. Ready? Oh, this one's fun. Ready? Go get it. Get it, Bryson. Are you tired? Are you tired? Bryson slept with me last night at the house here at Rescue House 2. Um, I started with Betty. What You're doing it while I'm watching? At least you're not sneaky. Hey, what do you want to eat wood for, boo? What do you want to eat wood for? No, leave it. Eh, eh. Oh. 
Bryson. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. No. No. <laughs> oh, these two make me, they make me smile. <clears throat> Give kisses, Anisette. Don't you start now. Stop it. You want to go back in your rooms? Come on, let's go. Who wants a treat? Who wants a meatball? Come on, let's go get meatballs. Come on. Meatballs? Um, so again, sorry, I get distracted. Thank you for bringing that to my attention. <laughs> Eyes everywhere. Oh, I see. Anna said shoot it first, and then Bryson followed. I see. Thank you. At least I know we have proof we started it, Anna said. They're nothing but love, and they keep me going. And this is why we continue our fight for these little souls that have nobody but us. So, um, oh, Danielle, thank you so much. And yes, we will get justice for Zora. Uh, I, I would definitely say, listen, if you want to donate a Publix gift card, um, if you want to donate um, a night of a hotel, I think it ranges from like $70. Um, if you'd like to maybe get a couple of friends together and you can pitch in and get a night for a hotel, um, you know, it's about $70 a night we're looking at, I think. So I'm calling around. I've been calling and checking. And, you know, it, it blows my mind because everybody has seen this story. Everybody. It has gone so viral, as it should be. Um, and that's because of our voices. Um, I, I always said that media, the news, is a tool. And it works. It it. It takes it to a whole nother level. Come on. Come on. I know. Come on. It takes it to a whole other level, uh, which is why I have been in such close contact um, with the media and continuously uh, allowing them to come to the rescue house to report, report, report um, on this case on Zora. Uh, horrific. It is a national. It correct. Um, it has gone completely national. It's everywhere. So we're going to continue to be Zora's voice. That I can promise you. Um, I needed that this morning. Mm -hmm. Your belly's all full. You had good breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> oh, kiss your mangy head. I love your mangy head. I love you. I love you. So I will post the information. Uh, thank you, Dina. Um, I will continue the continue to keep the heat on uh, with the media. I am looking for assistance for all of you uh, to be able to help and assist with Wanda if you choose to. Uh, to donate, like I said, a Publix gift card that will get directly to her um, and a hotel. So that's what we're working on right now. We are also going to be getting Zora's remains once the cremation is um, complete. And then we are going to start immediately focusing on a uh, memorial for Zora. Uh, but for, while we're doing all of this, we are never going to take our focus off of bringing justice for Zora and making sure that he pays the maximum penalty. <coughs> so it's time to get off this video and go have some coffee and get the rest of the babies out. Everybody, we'll be back later with more videos. Uh, I just wanted to say good morning and kind of update you. All the information that I just mentioned to you will be posted on this video when I shut down. And remember, if you can help in any way um, with Wanda, uh, a lot of people are reaching out and want to help her. So I will put the email address, our email. <coughs> you can reach out to me and I will make it happen. 100 plus abandoned dogs of Everglades, Florida. This is Amy. Happy Saturday.